Good morning, everyone. I'm Danny Dows, and it is time for your daily tech report from our Pepsi Tech Center. Amazon's first smartphone, the Fire Phone, hits store shelves tomorrow. Mixed reviews are out about the 3D phone, available for $200 at at and t with a two-year contract. The pros, it can scan millions of Amazon items, the screen holds up well in sunlight, and you get a free year of Amazon Prime. The cons, it's missing key apps and the battery won't last a day. Gadget lovers are still loving iPhones. Apple sold more than 35 million of them between April and June. And some folks may be holding back for the bigger screen iPhones expected soon. iPad sales, however, were weak. And iTime is the name of Apple's new smartwatch. The U.S. Patent and Trademark Office granted Apple a patent for a, quote, electronic wristwatch. There are hints that Apple's vision of iTime is different from any other smartwatch on the market. It may not need to be paired with another device to do things like read email or check the weather. And it could be a modular device with modules such as a media player able to be snapped into the wristband. Now that's your Daily Tech.